It was pitch black, even blacker than black, if such a thing is possible. My mother used to say, darkness is like a monster. If you let your fear win, then the darkness can devour you. Stare into the darkness, then the darkness will disappear. My name is Masih Ali Nejad. I'm an Iranian author and a campaigner for women's rights. And this is my story. I grew up in a small village in Iran where girls are forced to wear hijab. I had too much hair. Imagine I had to cover them up, even inside the house, because I grew up in a traditional family. I was a rebellious teenager. I used to ask so many critical questions. That is why I got expelled from high school. At my next high school, I distributed pamphlets against the government, and I was sent to jail. Later, as a political journalist, I got expelled from Iranian parliament, again, for asking critical questions. The more questions I asked, the more trouble I got into. In 2009, the government of Iran gave me a choice. Leave the country or go to jail. So I left. I now live in New York, but my questioning hasn't stopped. I launched a campaign called My Stealthy Freedom to help Iranian women challenge compulsory hijab laws in Iran. When we fight against compulsory hijab, we are not fighting against a piece of cloth. We are fighting for our dignity. We are fighting for our identity.